Heavy storms that blow in from the Mediterranean are a regular occurrence in the eastern part of Spain in autumn and winter. But scientists believe our warming climate is now supercharging these natural events in a number of ways. The Mediterranean Sea has been exceptionally hot in recent months, up to 30 degrees Celsius in some places. All that extra heat has added extra energy, water vapour and instability to these big storms. Let's have a look at how those warmer waters have influenced these floods. This is an image of the Valencia region in Spain taken just a few weeks ago. Compare that to this image taken just after the floods. Scientists say that climate-driven droughts have dried out the soils, likely increasing the speed and the breadth of the rain runoff. From Europe to the US to Asia, many parts of the world have seen extremely heavy storms and dangerous floods this year. Scientists say that over the past two decades, our ongoing reliance on fossil fuels has made the very worst events more frequent and more lethal. But a rapid move away from coal, oil and gas could limit the deadly impact of these storms. If we now really get our act together and stop burning fossil fuels, which we can because we have the knowledge and technology to go away quickly from fossil fuels, we will avoid these events from getting even worse in the future. Other factors undoubtedly influence the scale of the destruction in Spain. Experts say that some homes have been built on dried up riverbeds or areas prone to flooding. Questions have been asked about the inability of modern infrastructure to cope with extreme downpours. That's because our roads, bridges and streets have been built to deal with last century's climate, not the one we're experiencing now. Matt McGrath, BBC News.